This video will cover recharging, calibration, and basic flight maneuvers for your new Hubzen X4 quadcopter. You will need the X4 quadcopter, the controller, the rechargeable LiPo battery, and the USB adapter cable. We will start by charging the battery. Start by connecting the small end of the USB adapter cable to the battery. The other end should be connected to a computer. The red LED light will turn on when charging and turn off when the battery is fully charged. Insert the battery into the cavity on the bottom of the X4 quadcopter so that the wires are sticking out of the open end. Connect the two cables. A proper connection with a charged battery will turn on the LED lights on the quadcopter. Twist the extra cable length and tuck it in next to the battery so that it does not swing free during flight. The next step is calibrating the quadcopter. Set the quadcopter down on a flat surface. Power on the transmitter, making sure the left stick is all the way down and the right stick is in the neutral position. Enter expert mode by pressing the right stick into the controller. You should hear two beeps and the word expert should appear on the transmitter's screen. While holding the left stick down and to the right, move the right stick horizontally back and forth until the lights on the quadcopter blink. This indicates a successful calibration. Exit expert mode by pressing the right stick into the controller. The word expert should no longer appear on the screen. Here are some basic flight controls. Push the left stick left or right to change the yaw, or the direction the quadcopter is pointing. Please note, steering with yaw can be very difficult for beginners. We advise steering with only the right stick. Move the right stick up or down to alter the pitch, moving the quadcopter forward or backward. Move the left stick left or right to change the quadcopter's roll. Be sure not to stick your fingers into the propellers while they are moving. To turn the LEDs on the quadcopter on and off, press and hold the altitude trim button. Now you are ready for your first flight. Set the quadcopter down on a flat, sturdy surface, away from buildings and trees. Press down on each of the propellers to make sure that they are firmly attached. Warning, be sure to stand at least 20 feet away from the quadcopter when flying. Push the left stick up and down to control the quadcopter's altitude. To land, make sure the quadcopter is level by releasing the right stick. Then, slowly move the left stick down to decrease its height. Be sure not to descend too quickly. While flying, keep in mind the controls gone over in the previous steps. Be free, little copter! 